What's up, YouTubies? It's that country CEO back in the house again. Man, look, I'm on a roll here. They spit, I'm spitting them out like it's gold right about now. Welcome to the channel. Uh, back to the channel, subscribers, family, and friends. We're talking about dudes for new dump truckers, and I'm on a roll. What we've been talking about, wisdom, when to ask the right question, when to shut up, uh, being respectful, maintaining your equipment, being on time, and then the other words, being a person of your word. That's five I've given you. Here goes number six out of seven it is network with other dump truckers network with other truckers hot head getting hot now network with other truckers see that wisdom comes when you uh last video talked about when you they huddle up around and you you talking and stuff like that but then you listening a part of your listening is to discern and determine who's who who is the good guy in this bunch and who's the butthole because there's always buttholes Who's the good guy in this bunch? Who's the guy most likely that don't mind helping you? And who's going to be the guy that ain't going to tell you nothing to help you because he afraid you're going to get more than him? you That's why you're listening. Because when people talk, you tell the world about yourself. So when you find that good guy, discern that good guy, determine who's the good guy, then you catch him off to the side. Hey, man, uh, you think uh, it's possible I could get your number and you, you get my number and maybe we could network together? You need others to live. You cannot have a long ranger mentality in the dump truck business. You will not survive on your own. And yes, some of them ain't going to help you, but don't let that stop keeping you from working and, and networking with guys who will. Right? Because there are some good cats out there everywhere around this country that, that will help you, that understand helping you ain't hurting me. Talk, boy! Some people still understand that helping you ain't hurting me. Because a guy like me, I understand that the blessings come from up here. Me helping you ain't going to hurt from what comes from up here. Because what's for me is for me. That's what they used to say in the church house. What's for me is for me. When God Taylor makes a blessing, y'all want me to preach now. When God Taylor makes a blessing, the blessing is Taylor made for me. It ain't going to fit you. That's why David, when he got ready to fight Goliath, they wanted to give him their armor. He said, no, I can't fit that. I'm going to fight with what I got. So blessings are tailor-made for you. So find that guy, right? Network with other people. It'll help you along the way. It'll help with the learning curve. It'll get you some work, and it'll take you a long way. That's all I got for you. Hit the like, hit the subscribe, notification bell. I'm gone.